Hello everyone, so today's video is a screenshot redraw and if any of you guys don't know what that is, basically it's where you take like a screenshot of um, an episode like of a TV show or a cartoon and then you redraw that screenshot in your own style. And I decided to do Adventure Time because if any of you guys don't know this about me already, I love Adventure Time a lot. So um, I thought that'd be really cool to do and I chose to do the screenshot of Marceline and Princess Bubblegum. And I can't for the life of me tell you what episode this is from, but um, I'll try and find it out and put it in the description. Also, super quick, important um, announcement and this is really like urgent, just letting you guys know. Um, I am working on tomorrow's video, so Sunday's video, and it was very highly requested last week that I draw you guys in like a Christmassy themed video. So um, someone had the idea that I draw you guys in Christmas sweaters or Christmas jumpers. Also, <laughs> I have a really funny story to do with that, I'll tell you that in a minute. But um, I started a hashtag on Instagram for anyone that wants to be drawn by me in tomorrow's video. And I'm telling you about this now so you can go and post that as quickly as possible because you're going to want to do that if you want to be in tomorrow's video. Although I might do a part two so don't worry too much. If you go onto my Instagram uh, which is at jenna.drawing um, you will find the post about this and the hashtag is hashtag Christmas draw me Jenna. And um, Basically, all you need to do is post a selfie or a picture of you wearing a Christmas sweater or a Christmas jumper and um, If you don't have either of those things, then don't worry. Just wear something Christmassy like a Santa hat or something Whatever will work for you, whatever you have. I don't need to go out and like specifically buy a Christmas Shirt or something. It's fine um, But if you don't have anything Christmassy at all, don't worry about it. It's fine like um, I'll probably be able to draw you in a future uh, Draw Me Jenna and it just won't be um, a Christmas themed one. But if you guys really urgently want to be drawn by me, um, definitely go enter right now so you have a chance of being in tomorrow's video or a part two if there is one. And now I will tell you guys the funny story to do with this. So when I originally made my post, I put um, make sure you wear a Christmas jumper and not everyone knew what I meant by that and I forgot like um, uh, the dialect for what a jumper or a sweater is is um, entirely uh, different in different areas of the world because in England we call it a Christmas jumper but I forgot that um, in America and some other places it's called a Christmas sweater so a lot of people saw make sure you wear a Christmas jumper and got very confused because they didn't know what I meant so just a little bit of clarification here I did mean a Christmas sweater but um and I also had lots of people telling me oh my god I can't I don't have a Christmas sweater and stuff like that um so like I said it's fine don't worry too much if you don't have one um just post something where you are wearing something somewhat Christmassy and if you still don't have anything at all then just enter in a future draw me Jenna that isn't Christmas themed um but what else was I going to say? Um, I will be working on that tonight, so like I said, ASAP, make sure you post them. And I think I might do it as a traditional video, so rather than drawing you guys digitally, I'm going to use my toned paper and my Prismacolor pencils, because I'm not really even sure if I've done too many videos like this that on my channel, so it would be really cool to do that. Um, so yeah, make sure you guys go and watch that tomorrow. Um, because that would be super cool. And yeah, that's basically that. So back onto this video. Um, I actually drew the picture, the first half of the video, might look a bit different because it was drawn on my laptop rather than my computer. And um, I did this in about early September, so um, quite a while ago now. And I, I kind of noticed that my art style looks a little bit different in this video. So if you're wondering why that was, it's because this was an old video, but um, I really needed to get a video out this weekend and I realised I'd never finished this drawing, so I thought it would be a really good idea just to try and finish this drawing in this video. So um, I did struggle a bit with it, just because it's just, the way I started it off is so different to how 
I draw now. It's really weird to think that I've changed so much in that, um, in such few amount of time. I mean, few months. That didn't make any sense at all. But you guys know what I mean. Um, so that was really odd. Oh, and one other thing that I really want to talk to you guys about. Because uh, my internet got fixed recently, I should be able to start live streaming again soon. And I thought it'd be so cool to do like a Christmas live stream. I've been saying this for like the whole year. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have anyway. And I did say at one point in my last live stream, oh, I should do like a massive artist live stream, have some people join me on Skype and we all stream together. And then I thought, well, actually, I'm just imagining how it will be. If we have like 11 artists live streaming, that will be... Uh, very hectic. There'll be a lot of people trying to talk at the same time, so I don't know if I'm going to do some like massive artist live stream or something like that. I'm not sure how well that would work, but um, I'm, it might just be me. I might have someone else join me. I might ask Zoe if she wants to join me, but um, I thought a Christmas live stream would be so cute, and then you guys can give me like Christmassy requests in the um, chat and stuff like that. And yeah, I just really miss live streaming. I want to live stream again, um, but. In the comments below, you guys should vote on whether you think I should do a traditional live stream or a digital live stream. Actually, you know what? Not in the comments. I'm going to put like um, one of the uh, on video polls that you can do. I'm pretty sure. Okay, if I do this right, there should be a card that pops up like right now that says um, vote for what you want the live stream to be. And then I'll just put two options and you guys can vote. Um, and I do check those polls when I do put them on a video and it's really helpful because it um, it's, gets your guys' input in like an easy way to read. So yeah, scrap that idea. Don't don't comment it. I will have it on the screen in like a minute. Um, I'm back onto this drawing. Um, I'm kind of happy with how the hand came out. I was gonna say I don't I didn't really have a hand reference, but I did. That's not really true. I have my own hand and I was trying to work out how to draw the hand by using my own hand. It's still not like perfect, but I really like how I shaded it and I like how I used the purple on the skin. That's one thing I think I went wrong with in the um, drawing of Princess Bubblegum because I shaded... I don't know, it's really weird because obviously I gave Marceline's skin like a green tint, but I also added like this purplish shading to it and I thought it added like a really cool look. I'm not really sure how it did that, but um, I was gonna say it added like another layer of dimensionality, but that doesn't make any sense at all. I don't know what I'm talking about, <laughs> but basically, I didn't really do that on Princess Bubblegum. Like, um, I, I did try and shade with blue initially, I think, but it just wasn't working. Like, the pink and the blue weren't mixing together particularly well. So, um, yeah, I don't know, <laughs> uh, but. I also found it really difficult to do this drawing because they're both in profile view and I don't know if any of you struggle with this as well, but I find it so difficult to draw someone like side on in profile view. I mean, I've been practicing, I've been trying to get better at it, but um, this still doesn't change the fact it's super hard. Because I don't know, I'm used to drawing people from the front because it's a lot easier. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed this, but for most of the video I was procrastinating doing Marceline's ear because ears are my worst nightmare. I thought hands were bad. I think I think feet are even worse than me, but I don't tend to draw feet too often. But um, ears, on the other hand, ugh, ugh, I try and avoid them when I can. That's why, like, most of the time, I'll try and cover the ears with the hair so I don't have to draw them. And also, I just want to say, literally, like, the um, layer functions, like, I forgot what they're called the like layer modes um, saved my life in this drawing because I realised, because they've kind of got like a green environment behind them, they didn't really look um, like they were integrated enough into that so I had to use some of the layer modes to make them look a bit more green-ish so they would blend in a bit more with that but um, yeah my only regret with this is that I didn't do like a Christmas Christmassy video today and I really wanted to but obviously tomorrow when I end up drawing you guys that will be a Christmassy video and um, I'm really excited for that and if if you guys really like it if you guys give me um, good feedback on that um, I will be able to post um, another one next week and also I'm thinking of doing a drawing your OCs Christmas edition so uh, drawing your OCs with like Santa hats and Christmas jumpers and stuff like that. Anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed this week's video and I will see you again tomorrow, hopefully. Bye guys!